Hi, I'm Robert Silen, working on community advocacy at MariaDB Foundation. With me, I have Kai Arne, our CEO. Hi, Kai. Hi, Robert. I'm trying to get a grip on the features in the recent MariaDB 11.4 release. Well, you should. It's our newest LTS, our newest long-term support release, and it has lots of new features compared to 10.11, which is the previous LTS. So what feature do you want to look into now? Well, looking at the release notes for 11.4, the first, first one the item there is the optimizer, and specifically its cost model. Kai, what is that? So the optimizer is a key part of any database, and it decides the most efficient way to answer a query. And it does so by determining the order of the tables which are read and the which indexes it's using. And what about the cost model? So every optimizer has some kind of a structure that determines how costly it would be to answer the question doing uh, in, a, in this order or in that order. And, and uh, the cost, the, th that's the idea with the cost model. And it was now completely rewritten in 11.4. Cool. And how does that work? Um, AI, magic, plain logic, statistics? Well, not AI, but all of the above, uh, uh, perhaps. So the, the database obviously knows how big a table is and how big the indexes are. But it can also analyze uh, what works and doesn't work and provide the optimizer's uh, cost uh, model with a histogram. So, so the analyzed table looks at, at the uh, detailed structure of the data inside the index. Well, you say analyze table. I think that's even a command in, uh, in MariaDB. Or, but do I have to run that, or does this work out of the box? So most of the optimizer works right out of the box, but, but you can tweak it. You can uh, give more guidance by asking such a command, uh, analyze table. I have myself some experiences of getting very slow responses or even timeouts on my database queries, and I've had to add manual hints. Is, is all that part of the past? It sort of is. You can forget those hints more or less completely in the in the future, because because the cost model is is now better and optimized so so that it it uh, renders. We've we've ex experimented with this, and, and our users have, and uh, the guesses uh, which were overridden by these hints are are now better guesses from the uh, new cost model. Cool. So faster is always better, but who, who will benefit the most? Who will have the fastest database thanks to this? Well, those who have really large and complex queries, and complex queries meaning those that span multiple tables, they will see the most significant uh, benefit. So if you have a query with just one table and, and, and you have a where clause for the key, there's no difference, obviously. But uh, many applications in banking and, and elsewhere have uh, they have queries that span many, many tables where, where many, three would be a small number, 10 would be really large, and they will experience huge improvements. We've heard about, um, for instance, uh, Wikimedia Foundation, who have quite complicated queries where, where they have introduced hints into their queries that are no longer needed. Cool. So even Wikipedia and Wikidata will be faster. That's very impressive. Thank you for the overview about the optimizer, Kai. Uh, I guess there's more details in the release notes. Yes, in the release notes, and uh, there's pointers onward to the individual pages in the knowledge base. But I think that's enough for now. There's a lot of other uh, features in 11.4. Yes, I'm going to ask about them in upcoming episodes. Thanks for the optimizer overview. My pleasure. The MariaDB Foundation is the global contact point for collaboration on MariaDB Server. Our work is made possible thanks to the support of our sponsors.